Testicles, testicles. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> you don't clap, you just stick together. <laughs> I, I don't want to hold up the uh, glory for the best man and the, the, the room speech. Um, what I would like to do first of all is uh, thank the James family of the time and Paul. He's had to suffer. And that's better. Eh? He switched it on now. This is all for you guys, just to get, get out all the equipment and working properly. But they, they said, oh, actually, he's had to suffer. We have shared them with him. But that's the problem of being a little too old fan, isn't it? <laughs> 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 I know. Well, that's, that's what I like about him. He's going to have a little Freddy. Probably, I hope, if they have some other little food. Ah! We've got some toffees in there as well. Uh, no, 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 no. Oh, oh, toffees. That's going to be me over now. Uh, what I'd like to do is just propose that we make a toast and try and prove it. Cheers! Cheers! There he is. Right. Yeah! Woo -hoo -hoo! Is everyone having a good time? Yay!
Oh. Oh. Say with a straight face. Thank you so much, Andy, for their love and support. And you've really made me feel like a family. And I've not really had the chance to say thank you properly. So thank you. Even when I fell through a chair halfway through dinner a few months ago, I could see through the tears of laughter that I was making a good, effective cinema world. They've got new guiding virtue now. It's all going to be ambulated. I'd also like to thank you for raising a beautiful and intelligent daughter. And I can assure you that she's in good hands now. And I'll do my utmost to ensure that she looks after me properly. <laughs> I can tell that happiness is the most important thing to me, so I'm not really super proud. My mum and dad, um, thank you for all the support over the years, and thank you for welcoming Sharice into the James Family Circle. Now, no matter what mad idea I've had over the years, you've always been there for me. Shaking your heads doesn't me. But you've always been there for me through thick and thin, and I can't thank you enough for that. Dad, especially, you've always given me the very best in advice and words of wisdom through the years, such as when you're in the pub, always make sure you have one for the road. <laughs> Problem is, there's five roads between my house and the pub. Explains <laughs> last night, really. <laughs> Three, yeah. But I couldn't ask for a better moment, Dad, and thank you for everything you've done. And ladies and gentlemen, the first toast, I would like to propose a toast to our families, to Diane, Sandy, Paul and Roger, our mum and dad. Hey! 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 Come on, dad. Chin chin. Any more time in this, but not? <laughs> Feels like a lifetime, eh? Thank you, Therese. Um, I'm sure everyone here will agree that Sharice looks beautiful today. Yeah. Yay! Yeah. Woo! And seeing you walk down the aisle today made me realise that we were very, very lucky, mate. We met seven years ago at work and we quickly became very close friends. Mainly at the Ladies at Lunch Club, <laughs> where I was an honorary member. <laughs> um, so I sat through what felt like a, a lifetime of hearing about shoes, handbags, <laughs> general women bitching about men, just so I could get to know Sharice a little bit better. And little did I know that just one year later I'd fall in love with my best friend. Aww. <laughs> Now, the first, time, the first time I knew Sharice was interested um, was quite late one night after work and I plucked up the courage to ask her for a, a quick drink after work and before I could even utter a word, she said, I'd love to. And that's kind of Sharice all over and really sums up our relationship. She's, well, she drops into it what she wants, I don't notice, and then she tells me afterwards. <laughs> She's <laughs> always one step ahead and always kind of leaves me speechless and I've never been more lost for words when I saw you walk down the aisle today. I knew that today you looked beautiful because you always look beautiful but nothing could have said in this time. Aww. I'm just trying to make a card. So you're pretty scary, <laughs> funny, intelligent, beautiful. And I'm so lucky that you have lowered your standards to be with me. <laughs> I've had the best six years of my life with you and look forward to spending the rest of my days by your side. Um, over the years, I've tried to keep myself in good physical shape, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> you look more pregnant than she does. <laughs> Steve, shut up. <laughs> so the question is, is she satisfied with my body? <laughs> 
Tony Parton who likes to think so. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Ian Evans. <laughs> 